this piece when I saw it in a retail space just captured my heart straight away and actually I had the urge to tickle her feet because they are so tactile it's on display like this I just fell in love with it straight away and this guy is my one of my newly discovered favourite artists I thought I'd read a bit about what, how he talks about this piece what the meaning is the most wonderful feeling and greatest responsibility is that of knowing that someone has complete trust in you. That feeling of total unabated abandonment in your hands. It's a great honour to be given the trust to carry someone's feelings in your hand. This powerful bonding force should never be broken, for it can make a mountain crumble in an instant. So if someone errs and realises their mistake, you must put your faith on the line so that they may rebuild that mountain of trust. And I think that meaning um, resonates quite a lot with my with me and with how I was feeling at the time that I discovered the piece. Actually, I, f I had feeling so strong I wanted to take it to bed like a teddy bear and just cuddle it. It's quite a lot of money though, so. I went on the internet and I discovered that there is a big art book all about his work and I love art books. They're the best kind of books, big, heavy, ginormous discovery books, they're the best kind and I love them. So this week I did actually buy his art book so I was really excited about that. So, he comes with a, co in a copper box with his name on. It's not amazing. It's so cool. You see, he's got the tissue paper that I love. Oh my god. Oh, okay. piece on the front, oh wow, and the old letters are sort of goldy, sort of colour. Oh, I love this book. And it's got all these descriptions, you know, descriptions about his thoughts about love, description about what the peace means. It's a gorgeous book. I, love, I really love this piece as well huge coffee table which I wouldn't be able to fit in my house but I just love the meaning behind it I'll read it out to you soulmate one of the most comforting thoughts is to know that the person beside me creates a wonderful balance in my life and that together we can weather any storm 
What's that zoom out here? Love, there is no greater love than the one that grows day by day. I do get quite sensitive at art pieces. I did almost cry in front of Matisse painting. And then when I went into the Mark Rothko room and the Tate Modern, as you go from the bright light, then I went into this sort of dull light. It was like, at the video, it was like, whoa. I need to sit down. So it, so I do get quite emotional, proper emotional about art. And I love art and I love art books. Big, exciting art books, big ones, you know, the whole carrying your arms with two hands because it's stupid and exciting. I love this loving. And this piece, I just feel is so important just to my heart. Is because the feeling of um, being loved and just held like that, like all loved and cared for someone who loves you and you can just relax and sink into their soul. That's why I love this piece so much. The adoring, that the feet just chase the sense of being adored, totally adored and loved. And some, that's something I crave. So I love this piece. I just love it. <laughs>